here is a quick update on the language uh, about this Microsoft um, wireless all-in-one all in uh, keyboard or the long name I mean what the hell is, is this called Microsoft wireless all-in-one media keyboard good um, as I said this was a Turkish keyboard but the letters would not register it uh, I just noticed uh, there's something called language setting and I downloaded a second language as Turkish so if I select this like this now like the soft G is going to work just like this okay so I can basically switch between soft G or or uh, Turkish and English on the fly like I can place this G's here or or U which is not working the one thing is it all also affects my actual keyboard so instead of for example um, making the bracket I am also making the soft G with this button uh, because uh, it applies to all keyboards the language the Windows keyboard setting changes but I can always change it back to here to English and now uh, my brackets are suddenly actual brackets which are also brackets even though there's no bracket here so if I press that it's gonna be the uh, bracket uh, here as well so it was important to do that and I managed to do that from the uh, language settings so in the uh, settings home uh, I never do the deal with this but there's something called time and language and if you go to region and language there was only English before and then I clicked on add language and I added a language and that language is now Turkish um, it downloaded two things the Turkish uh, keyboard and the Turkish some setting pack but there are also other things available like the language pack that I can download and even the handwriting or speech and what's going to affect is uh, something like speech so for example I have uh, only English uh, text-to-speech here you have selected Microsoft Sierra as the default voice so let's turn it on and let's use this I just put the nylon bag on it but it should work you have selected Microsoft Sierra as the default voice yeah but then if I were to download the Turkish language pack probably it's gonna appear here I didn't do it I don't know if I will do it for the fun of it but I also now cleared out that 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 uh, important issue uh, which is only uh, available uh, for the Turkish uh, version of it so most of most of you who will order this as English uh, don't have to deal with this but uh, that was the only other issue remaining uh, that uh, was a question and now I can use it as a Turkish keyboard which is very important for uh, Turkish emailing uh, and uh, communication because my Dell laptop just purchased in the United States has the English keyboard which is fine everything but uh, communicating uh, in Turkish and I was having difficulty my language uh, my letters would uh, appear weird so because I, can, I don't have the soft G I was only using the G for the G and the soft G uh, and it appears very weird and now I can uh, type this and even my own name has Turkish characters in it so now I can type my own name uh, as is in Turkish so that was all and um, I'm gonna turn this off one thing I noticed is uh, this light here at the corner only turn only remains on for a couple of seconds like 10 seconds when you turn it on so here I will turn this on now so the light comes out Five, six, seven, eight, ten. Yeah. So after ten seconds, it is off. Uh, it's understandable not to consume, to co not consume battery. It should be off. Um, I cleared that one out. So so far, so good. Uh, all my initial impressions uh, are uh, now uh, recorded, and most of them are positive other than the flimsiness and sometimes unresponsiveness or uh, quirkiness of this which is however is not even perfect on my own touchpad 
uh, everything else seems to be so far so good. The quality is okay. As I said, some labels were coming out, but um, uh, for the moment, the labels the labels are only slightly coming out. And it's barely recognizable. Uh, you might not even see it. Uh, so from now on, only time will tell how good of a purchase this keyboard is. But uh, my initial, uh, I will. I'm not really rating it, but my initial impression, the initial impression of this keyboard on me, is a positive one. And that's all for today. Thank you for watching.